Hi everyone, welcome to targeting part one. Now targeting is, is an essential technique uh, as we need to keep track of where the enemy is so that we can shoot at them or ram in them or perform whatever action we need to. Now this can be difficult to do as you will see some robots don't just follow around the edge of the map. They may do more complicated tasks such as this. This is the sample crazy robot and as you can see it randomly moves around and just shoots when it sees another bot in sight. So we're going to look at some techniques of being able to target these robots. Here I've created four uh, robots each with a different targeting technique. We're going to look at the first two in this video. So the first one is very simple uh, it's called spinning radar and all it does is it keeps turning around 360 degrees over and over and over and it just shoots when it gets uh, a bot in sight. <clears throat> now this code here doesn't shoot but it is an example of what we could do. So I'll demonstrate this now. So you can see our spinning radar is just turning around and we could in implement some code here that we could move towards the bot or move away or we could shoot every time we get that event saying there is a bot in sight. Now it is obvious this code is not very effective but there are circumstances where it may be used such as classes that, uh, like nanobots where having minimal code is a key element. And all this does here we've got this function turn radar right radians and we we'll specify to turn it infinitely. Our next robot has an infinity lock and this tries to lock onto the bot and so that we don't lose it. We don't have to keep scanning around we just scan when we lose sight of the robot. So let's run this now. Here you can see we've got a lock on the bot but every time Crazy moves away from our lock, we search again. You can see that this is much better code than our previous example, although we do lose lock on it every now and again and have to rescan. So in our next video, we'll be looking at how to keep an, a perfect lock on our bots.